Ye have on gently, Brutus, stole from my bed. And yesternight at supper he suddenly arose and walked about, musing and sighing with your arms across. And when I asked you what the matter was, you stared upon me with ungentle looks. Yet I insisted. Yet you answered not, but with angry wafture of your hand gave sign for me to leave you. So I did, fearing to strengthen that impatience, which seemed too much enkindled, and withal hoping it was but an effect of humor, which sometime hath his hour with every man. It will not let you eat, nor talk, nor sleep, and could it work so much upon your shape, as it hath much prevailed upon your condition, I should not know you Brutus. Dear my lord, make me acquainted with your cause of grief. Brutus is wise, and were he not in health, he would embrace the means to come by it. Is Brutus sick? And is it physical to walk unbraced and suck up the humors of the dank morning? What? Is Brutus sick? And will he steal out of his wholesome bed to tempt the vile contagion of night and dare the roomy and unperjured air to add on to his sickness? No, my Brutus. You have some sick offense within your mind, which by the right and virtue of my place I ought to know of. I charm you by my once commended beauty, by all your vows of love, and that great vow which did incorporate and make us one, that you unfold to me yourself, your half, why you are heavy. And what men tonight have had to resort to you? For here have been some six or seven who did hide their faces even from darkness. Within the bond of marriage, tell me, Brutus. Is it accepted that I should know no secrets that appertain to you? Am I yourself, but as it were in sort or limitation, to keep with you at meals, comfort your bed, and talk to you sometimes? If it be no more, Orsha is Brutus's harlot not his wife. If this were true, then should I know this secret? I grant, I am a woman, but with all, a woman that Lord Brutus took to wife. I grant, I am a woman, but with all a woman well reputed. Cato's daughter, think you I am no stronger than my sex, being so fathered and so husbanded. Tell me your counsels. I'll not disclose them.